Hi everyone, this is Ida with Created to Create. I have a quick project share. This is the third time, guys, I'm recording. For some reason, my phone keeps turning the video the wrong way. Um, so anyway, I saw a video, uh, the lady's name was in the event with K Karem. And I will post a link in the description box of her original video. And she made a dress form, you guys. She made the whole dress form. I only did half of it. And uh, I did it a little differently. Like, I didn't do the pieces that she did up here on the sides. And I didn't do what she did on the on the top. I kind of kept it a little bit more simple. Um, but I love the results. Here's what it ended up looking like. Look at how beautiful that is. And uh, here's the back. Let me share the back with you. And there's the back. I did taper it down. And you can see the waist right here where it tapers down and then it flares out. And, uh, of course, this is the center of the back. And I want to share with you what it originally looked like. It is a trash uh, waste basket from the Dollar Tree, you guys. And it's these right here. Uh, the little wire ones. And they are coated in plastic. So, um... It was real easy to do, you guys. And if I start to feel a little bit better, I will do a process video. Or if enough people are interested, because really the lady who did the original video, even though she's not talking, you can see what she's doing. So it might not be something I'm going to, to do, but um, this is what it was. And these come in the black, guys, and they come in white. And uh, I only picked up some white, and I only I picked up five. I originally wanted ten, and I said, no, I'm just going to get three. And then Abby said, no, Mom, you better get uh, more because you're going to wish you had. And the, the nearest Dollar Tree to me is like 45 minutes to an hour away. So anyway, I, I ended up just getting a couple more. So I got five in total, all white. But look at how pretty this basket is, you guys. This would be awesome to house... Um, uh, if you're doing a swap with somebody, you could put all the goodies in here. This would be a great Valentine's basket. This would be a great Mother's Day basket. A great uh, basket just for organization. A great basket for um, happy mail. And even a great basket for those of you who crochet or knit. And you can stick the ball of yarn in there and pull out the yarn through one of these little holes. And to crochet or knit whatever it is you that you do and keep the ball of yarn contained and it is super cute guys this lace right here was was originally this one was gifted to me by my friend Carolyn but uh, after I ran out I was able to find it and I bought some more so I've got this trim on either side of the basket and then this lace right here ribbon was also gifted to me by my friend Carolyn and I just kind of weaved it in back and forth. And I wrapped the handle as well in the same ribbon. And then this little heart right here is the little heart that I picked up from the Dollar Tree that I showed yesterday in a haul, you guys. This little piece was sitting on my desk. I think it's absolutely stunning. And then this trim right here. I think was gifted by Miss Emma Mangifico during the Not So Secret Santa swap. And she gave me plenty of it, you guys. I, I had enough to go all the way around my prod my project. And here's the handle. You can see it's wrapped up in the pink. And then I did add a little bow right here with the same ribbon. And another one of those little hearts because this ribbon has the bling. And the bling and the heart, the, the color matches on both. So that's what I ended up doing, guys. Now, if I would recommend one thing for if you're going to use it for crochet, right here where I cut it and bend the prongs down or the little wire down, I would add another uh, strip of ribbon or lace or whatever on the inside right here and kind of sandwich this uh, piece in between the two pieces of trim and lace. That's what I would do if I was going to use it for crocheting or housing my crochet uh, yarn. But... Um, what I'm going to do with mine is I have a bunch of packages of um, flowers that I bought or people have sent me. And I have them in a basket that's bigger, but it's very shallow, you guys. And everything kind of starts to pile up and fall over. I think this is better because of the front being higher and it will actually contain stuff better. And so this is going to be part of my room decor in my craft room. And I think I'm going to make another one and maybe use it as Happy Mail. I think somebody would be thrilled to get this, guys. And it, it cost me more in lace than, any, than anything else because the basket was only a dollar. 
I hope that you guys try this and make sure to check out the lady's uh, video that did this because they, you, then you can see exactly what she did and stop wherever you want to the way I did. Thanks for watching, you guys. I hope everyone has a great day and God bless. Bye.